Every golfer makes mistakes with their swing from time to time. However, I believe there are five deadly sins. Eradicate these five and you're well on your way to improving your golf game. Deadly sin number one is poor location of the left hand on the handle of the golf club. Too many golfers I see position the left hand so the handle is too much across the palm, resulting in poor position of the left hand on the handle. What I'd like you to do is, as I've done here, draw two lines onto your golf glove and then place the two lines onto the front side of the handle of the club. Curl your fingers around and then position the red dot, as I've done here, indicating the snuff box at the base of the thumb down through the front of the handle of the club. Number two would be poor posture. Too often we see golfers standing to the ball in a round-shouldered, slumped-over posture. Not really the best place to start the swing from. What I'd like you to do is to bend forward more from the hips. Try and visualize your belt and imagine taking yourself where you bend forward so the front of the belt would point more towards the golf ball and the back of the belt would go more towards the sky. Put a little flex in your knees and allow your arms to hang freely by your side. Sin number three would be an incorrect start to the swing. Too often we see golfers starting the swing with too much hand action, turning the club away from the ball and as a result taking the club off the desired plane. What I'd like you to do is to get yourself an aim stick, place behind the handle of the golf club as I'm showing you here, take your normal setup position with the aim stick resting against the outside of your left leg and then just practice the first movement of the swing ensuring that the stick stays attached to your left leg. This would keep the hands quiet and ensure that the golf club tracks back along the correct line. Number four would be faulty hip action. The golfer can tend to sway the hips to the right resulting in the weight going to the outside of the right foot. To fix this one, get yourself a chair, taking your setup position and position the chair just outside of the right leg. From here, rehearse some back swings, making sure that the right leg doesn't bump into the chair. This ensures that the angle of the right leg would stay constant, keeping the weight nice and centered. And the fifth sin is impact. Too often we see with golfers, the weight is on the back foot, and as a result, the golf club starts to move upwards. To fix this, grab yourself another golf club, place it onto the ground, and then from a relatively short backswing position, just allow your golf club to run into the end of the club there on the floor. This will help you sense your body weight more onto your front leg and the handle of the club slightly forward of the club head when you make contact. Eradicate these five sins from your golf game and you're gonna see your game improve.